we came in this camp, and it was real torture. First of all, you had to they stripped your clothes, whatever it was you had still from your home, from your house, and you were practically just naked. The only thing I had left was a comb which I was hiding in my hair. And um, you can imagine how you feel. You had to walk, you know, strip your clothes and walk out on the street, all naked, young girls. This was the very big humiliation. And um, before we uh, got undressed, we were on the field sitting, and everybody talked about, well, that's it, that's our end, that's our end, we're going to crematoriums, and that's all, because this was, they did, they put you in crematorium there, the, the ovens just went constantly, the fire was burning constantly. And then they addressed us, and we did go, of course, you, you didn't know if you're going to be guests or not, which we went to the, to the bathhouse, they call it, you know, and that's what they said, the bathhouse. And sure enough, we, uh, we got water instead of gas. The second day when they gave us the barracks to, to sleep, we just slept on the floor. Uh, the food, even today, I can't even imagine how we did it and how we ate. Just water on grass, that's all it was. Grass, there was no bread, they didn't give us any bread. Um, they literally starved you, just starved you. And here you came from home, from all right, the ghetto, but at least you had something, you know, you could survive on, or you made a deal or whatever. But here it was just, that's all you had. 